Iron Wars of Misery. That is a tough map. It's a tough one for Plague, I reckon. But we have an interesting build. We're literally gonna puke on every gen. And each gen stays infected for two minutes. Did that hit? It did. Two minutes? If my, if my math is right, that's pretty insane, isn't it? I wonder if you can puke on... On uh, Halloween pumpkins. That'd be funny. There's only one gen left. Uh, I I forgot I can't uh, infect directly. Or else that would have been free. Right. So now I have a minute window or so where gens. I can't infect directly, but I can infect the pallet and then she can touch it. And that's it. That's all the gems, right? Yeah, I mean, they could outweigh the corrupt. Good. Come on, here. Pallet and window. There you go. The other two are not touching gems. Really. That was good. This guy will be infected soonish, but... Is that my red fountain? No. It is not. Someone finally bit the bullet. Alright. Let's see how this works. It is a risky move. I'm giving them so much time if they react to that in a timely manner. Which they should. I'm afraid that now if they start to cleanse, I have very little. But we'll see. Oh my god. A Kaled that I didn't even touch is out of the injured. If a Tinkerer pops up now, that would be insanely good. Yeah! They've done less than half of the gen and they're out of the injured. That is powerful. Make no mistake. That is insane! Oh my god! Yellow, I don't unnecessary for this. But it does help that I don't need to babysit the gens as much. Wow, dude. She did the gen for like 20 seconds and she's out of the infected. That's the brown add-on. But as you can see... I can't, like, easily infect people that I meet normally, so... Let's pop it. Sure, I don't have another Tinkerer. After this is over, in a second, I do another round of puke every gen. Now that we don't have Corrupt, though, so... It's not as simple. Long time lurker here. Thank you for the entertainment. Mr. Anonymous, or Mrs. Anonymous, thank you. Recently, and I've been loving it ever since. Wonderful. Also, have you been to Las Baleari? Nope. Very close to it, but I've never been. P.S. No. I have had a lot of friends and colleagues from there, though. And I know it's quite lovely. Thank you. Well, now that they're all injured, should they honestly even be a threat? I'm not very sure myself. That could have worked, but I don't think we had it. Notice the very early pre-drop. It's probably a really good idea. <sighs> yeah, I think it's gonna be hard now. Good use. We held it? Oh, come on, dude. I'm not even near. This is just this map, dude. This is just this map being too fucking large for our own good. We could have a 3 gen on the side or whatever, but... Uh, that's gonna be tough. You serious? Ugh! I choked on my... Duke. Yeah, like, I have 60 seconds is nothing. When you have to... Spend 30 going from one place to another. They're all injured, though. They can't go for this rescue, easily. So. If they touch a gen, it gets infected. I don't even need to infect it myself. That's only in case they cleanse and try to touch that one. Mm -hmm. I won't touch that recently. Uh-huh. Go, go and cleanse, thinkies. Oh, they're trying. That was a bit of a mistake. Keep interrupting. It's eight seconds, not six anymore. Close. Is that hard? 
That was an insanely patient dead heart, and I couldn't have done any better, I think. Finally, they do it. The girl that can rescue will be infected if she touches the person on the hook. So this kind of works out. Bad as it is. Can you pick on hooks? No. Nope. Infected and that hard and then. And you need to be careful now. Um let's keep her here. This is close to all of our three gems, right? She's not fully infected, but still good. I'll kid this for not for the pop, but for the eruption. It's giving me some phantoms here now. I must infect I could that's not something I thought of, but I could infect uh, Palace prematurely. Like that. That girl that this girl just got infected. Just we puked on that. Uh okay. Let's hope this is good enough. Oh wow, the massive cleansing there. Do you think they'll do you think that's the way to react to this? Massive cleanse so that I cannot quickly infect everybody? Because I need to puke on things, not on people? Could be the way to deal with this atom. No clue where they are. Oh, I found you. That was pretty crazy. I think she's dead, bro. Oh, nice eruption. Did it make anyone scream? I don't think so. Are you the person that's dead? Oh shit, I think you are. I'm sorry. Oh dear. Thank you. Wait, let's wait two seconds actually. For eruption to be off cooldown. That girl got hit. There's blood at the bottom of this. Surprisingly. And if I were her, I would be going up. Yeah. There's someone else with us. Oof. Low projectile speed. Nice, we hit her. And eruption. And Tinker on the Shen. Maybe she thinks I'm not coming. Let's hope she doesn't hear the thing. A full spine chill? Oh, she knows. Nice. Let's pick her up. Let the other two recover. We got three gems. We can if we control that gen and get someone down and start the process, we can do it. So you see how you need to play differently with this add-on. Uh, but we're not even we're not even thinking for the chest just yet. We're not puking on like we could have been puking on every single hook. Sorry, uh, every single uh, you know window, uh, pallet and stuff. Because puking now is so free. It used to be that you puked and you were like, uh, 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 and then you start moving. But that's not how it works anymore. Now it's really really fluid. So you can do this ahead of time. If you're going through, you barely lose any time. And it does choke out their options, right? This Nia definitely wants a chase. Let's give it to her. If she's too good, we leave no shame in it. That would have been a play, but she kept running. That was not too close. Not too, not too far, actually. I think we got you. There's one. I think she's dead. She'll use that heart. But we just hold it for an extra second. Oh! <gasps> what? She disconnected immediately. Wow. This is like a killer friend. Yeah, uh, you're, you're the dummy. Wait. 
Wait, but the person that I downed was not the one that disconnected. Wait. Wait, it is. Wait, it is. It's... Oh, she never... What? She never picked up the Clavet. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Clavet, you've been on the ground for two and a half minutes. I thought... I didn't even look at the hut. I thought you had been up for a long time. She literally left you on the ground just to come here and, and do a 1v1 cow shed. Alright, dude. Left. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, Osama Allah. I suppose. <laughs> bye bye. Oh, come on, dude. Oh, I complain that the previous map is just too big to exert pressure, and then you hit me with this game. You hit me with this. Alright, let's learn. Window. And gen. It's two minutes. We could realistically be in a chase here in two minutes. So let's do that. Uh, to be fair, these guns are easy to hit. Okay, just some windows. Oh, someone's already infected. It must be this one. Damn it. Oh, who is it? I'm terribly curious now. There's not that many gems, only four. Maybe main building? That is a horrible phantom we were given. Damn, I just realized. Oh, <gasps> she's out of the injured. Oh my God, this add-on, bro. It's that one in the far back, it looks like. No Tinkerer, but if I get Tinkerer now, that would be disgusting. That Jill, if she stays, she's gonna be injured too in like two seconds. Bro, before even Tinkerer, they're already full injured. That's pretty nuts. It is really hard to get a survivor fully injured like this in a normal chase. I wish I had pop now. I mean, Ruin at least. Could make this even stronger. What? Dude, we would be in such a good spot. Such a good spot if it just wasn't for the fact that this map is huge. And so safe too. Quentin's gonna be injured by the time I reach. Oh, it's not Quentin. Nice. Alright, I'll take it, dude. Ah, come on, you cannot be this lucky. Oh, she wasn't. Hey, we hit that girl with eruption. Nice. Okay, plans coming together. Uh, this must be the girl that's not infected, Nia. Why are you giving me a free hit, son? Isn't that bad? For you? She also touched the generator, infected herself? Okay, dudes. That gem pops. But considering this is Mother's dwelling. Wait, it actually regressed enough for it not to pop? Yeah, piss off, Nia. We've had your kind before. No way, we stopped this. That would have been too good, right? Let's reapply eruption. And this would be like a mini pop. Is she just that hard into? Nice. Well, it didn't hit that gem because it didn't have it, but... Yeah, that is everyone fully infected without me directly puking on anyone. That's pretty nuts. We'll be losing gems, however, and Corrupt just uh, ended a few seconds ago, so... Yeah, well, that's a concern. Shame. We just, like, if we had a smaller map, dude, this plan would be pretty damn good. Damn. Yeah, that's just... Big map, and then there's the building aspect to it. That blows. Everybody's injured, though, dude. If I get them to just give me one good fountain, man. Just one good fountain. I just don't have any fountains, man. I'm playing 2017 play. Or whatever. They touch this part. Maybe I can chase them into it. Wait, if she touches it, that means no DS. Mm, maybe we should stay on her butt, then. Dude, they might, they might as well stay injured. They have maybe the best map in the game to be injured and just... That looks close. Yeah, they have the easiest pilots in the way in the game to be right now. Oh well, that's alright. If the build performs somewhat okay in this map, then it means it's pretty good everywhere else. Right? We have three survivors accounted for, but the one survivor that is not accounted for is gonna bring us to two gems. Actually, it is accounted for. Here she is. This guy is, I hate them. I hate them so much. They have it so easy, actually. Oh my lord. Thank Christ. That was such a dumb mistake. It was just a POV issue right now. 
where he dead harder into nothing and I didn't want him to dead hard through me. <laughs> so I messed up. Luckily he didn't react the fastest he could have. Damn it. Like, make no mistake, this is rough, but default play wouldn't be much better. Then again, if I had a yellow add-on that was an apple, I could be, you know, drinking from a fountain right now and going to town with everyone being injured, which I cannot. I just cannot, because my fountain is literally in the worst possible spot, man. Oh, but that was a mistake. Dude, imagine if I had a fountain right now. They cannot unhook in front of me. Even these pallets are not entirely safe. Okay, she doesn't panic. She's quite smart. We will bloodlust the heck out of her, though. Nah, we won't. You're injured. Go away. Alright, this guy hit stage 2, I suppose. Eventually she'll figure out that I'm gonna camp and she'll go to pick up the other girl, maybe? That's what I would do. Maybe if we chase this girl long enough, we can actually use our power. Did we ever hook this girl? That guy did hit stage two, yeah? Nice, stage two guaranteed, we got some value out of it. Final gen, sure, but we got Tinkerer. And what a sad, 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 sad fountain, man. Oh my god. Oh. Alright, so that's... How many people that don't hook? Three people that don't hook? It couldn't be. Two people that don't hook. This guy just drunk. Oh, yes. Tell me where. That could have that could have been Dutch, believe it or not. I knew she would. Oh wait a minute! He didn't do what I thought he would. I was gonna say he's not stupid, but then he ran into it, and he just luckily dodged it. Oh my god! Oh, and now they drink from the fountain that I had to take earlier. That's not even funny. Oh god, that hard. No, just... Right. <laughs> I'm gonna hit a DS. I'm gonna hit a DS. I'm gonna hit a DS. The guy's dead. I lost my power though, just now. That's rough. That's super rough. That is so hard, dude. We didn't do too badly, really, but... This girl's dead on hook. Watch out. Watch out. Pre-drop. Uh, nope, just hold forward. Jesus. She's taking me too far from the gates. I don't think anyone else is here. Hold up, I think I can catch you. That was... Promising. Alright, let's try a different manga. Oh, okay. Damn. I'm running out of time, guys. Uh, I got like, what, 20 seconds? But remember, uh, uh, projectile speed don't play very low. If you have that one purple add-on, it's a bit better. Nice. Well, she's not making distance anywhere, but... Oh my lord. I fucking knew it. Nicely done. We're gonna win because we can just... Um, keep her locked in here. And they cannot body block. Actually, maybe with this plague you could body block, potentially. You're dead, aren't you? Or is it Jill? No, you're not dead. You're on your second hook. Yeah. So, like, if I infect Jill like this, it won't even work. Oh, damn it. Is she dead hard? That's a BT babe, for sure. Uh, too close. Too bloody close, I'm afraid. The only thing I can hope they do is just, I don't know, mess up. I I could base camp that, but that's it.
What is she doing? Oh, I think I know actually. I think she's got Unbreakable on DS, maybe? Wait, are you sure you can get out? Oh, you messed up! I think you're dead. That girl is not a guaranteed kill. This girl is, I think. We just zone her out of the gate. If they have another gate ready, then GG, I guess. Shit, I don't hear her. She could have balance or whatever. I didn't catch her. This mind at that heart. Nice, we got her. Alright, we had to fight hard for those two kills. It's just... Oof. Yeah, at least you didn't disconnect like the other one. Mm. No, the window's fine. Like we, As you can see, once we're in chase, we can catch them. But we need our power. We need our power. Like, you understand, right? This is the largest map in the game. And even if it wasn't, if there was another map that was larger, it's large enough. If you come to a corner of this map, this gen they never f bothered doing, right? And I pick up my power from here. Look at just how far I am from everything. So I pick it up, 60 second timer. It takes me 30 seconds to get anywhere. And that's if the survivors just magically stand still. My only fountain is there. In this map, it would have been really, really nice to have... Well, this obviously doesn't help. But in this map, it would have been really, really, really nice to have an apple that just gave me... That just gave me... A chance to have a fountain that wasn't there. Because that was horrible. Still, though, you can see the strength of how quickly people get injured. With Tinkerer, that's kind of dangerous. I feel like more than Eruption, we could have had... We could have this build with Ruin and Pop. Because Ruin with this, I feel, is very strong. You stay on a gen, you do it for 30 seconds, you get fully uh, infected, then I come and bother you. What are you going to do? Tank ahead? Be greedy? No, you need to get out of there. And then Ruin starts eating it up. And then you have Pop as a backup with Tinkerer, which is really, really good. And in the first two minutes with Grub, you can do damage. I think this add-on combination is promising. More... Oh, I didn't say GG's. Uh, more testing to be, to be done, for sure. For us to know for, uh, for certain. Oh my god! Now that we understand this add-on better, we get the best map on Plague? Oh, to use it? Let's do it. So the idea, right, is... Yeah, you're not losing your ruin too early. Uh, puke, puke. Uh, we know better now. We have ruin instead of eruption, because we understand we're going to do things passively. And we brought a an apple, so even if we get better RNG, as soon as I puked on every single gen, and it looks like I just did, I might have forgotten one. We go. I go for the M1. All right. I need. I need a. I need a fountain right now. No, liver. Uh, this fountains are. I've got. Uh, I'm not using the double duration, so I don't have like two whole minutes. But I do have a bit of time. We're gonna use it just to set up and make this first. Um, consumption really strong. I'm saving this fountain because it's literally in the middle. And that is hard to come by. Yeah, I forgot to... I forgot to puke on my first gem. Did I? Or if I did, it ran out already. Close. This might be the only person. Oh, cheeky. Oh, that's not, e that's not easy, dude. There's very few particles that go through if you shoot that quick. But I think that that was a good delay. No tinkerers. Who are doing his job? Let's go. That, if you do that five times, you'll miss most, I feel. If she faked that, that would have been god tier play. Okay, that's it. My puke's gone. She dead hard, dude. Bruh. I just was puking on the thing, expecting her to drop it. Yo! Felix, what's up? The other girl eventually 
got fully infected. And remember, if they do actions that, that are on something that is infected... Oh, dude, this is an easy camp. Like, we literally have Ruin up, no Tinker. We know where everybody is. I would need to camp this to stage two. But I don't think we need to. It would be kind of nasty, so let's not. Shame we can't infect them on the hook, though. That would be pretty nice. I'm almost sure I know what the girl's gonna do. Did that hit? Oh no, I didn't snipe the gen. Why not? I should have. Well, I just ran out of my power. Alright, we have another go at it. Notice that if they want to do ruin, they almost, almost get fully infected from doing ruin. Almost. It takes, what, 12 seconds to do a. 14 seconds to do a totem? If you infect it. Dude, this... That heart... No. The new cooldown on Plague is so insanely nice, dude. The cooldown is the same, it's just the speed. Oh man, what a change. Can't you infect the hooks? No, the hooks cannot be infected. It's like hatch or... Uh, breakable walls. You cannot. This is the opposite of the last game we did. Like, we just have an entirely... Entirely good map for us. That was good for Mara, but she lost distance. That was a really good attempt. She needed to wait like a second longer. Hard to judge, huh? But you can infect the survivors that are hooked. Without this add-on, yes, guys, don't tell me wrong. But we have the add-on that doesn't let us do that. So no, it won't work. I can show you if you want, because I just ran out. See, completely immune. Typically, that would get them infected. I'm kind of... Right. But that would be bad, but now we have Ruin and Pop, and we've hang... <gasps> nice, nice. Remember, uh, this is, what, 40 seconds plus 30? It's 70 seconds, so a whole minute. It's not as oppressive as the others, as the other combination, but hey, I have an apple, so... I have even more phantoms now. We have time. Pick up, please. Um, I don't know... With this combination, what is the right play from them? I'm not even sure. Um, mass cleanse? Uh, get injured and... Wait, are you serious? Is he here? You can hit through uh, Suarez on the hook. Wait, what? Oh my god! D does this add on this? What? That, that was just bad luck? Can you not hit through survivors with this add on? Do some cooldown? Oh yeah, it might be the cooldown. Maybe we. Nah. Sometimes you can um, hit a survivor so quickly they are immune, but. That could have happened, it right? Surely not. That's crazy. Poor Fang. She was she really too hooked? Did she have stage two after all? Hey, first thinker. Let's put a stop to that. Maybe if I come from this weird angle, she, they won't notice me. That's a survivor that maybe has spine chill. <laughs> Damn it. I like it. Stealth killer. How am I doing? Hi, Infernus. I, I feel like I'm cheating, dude. I don't know. I don't think the average group of survivors handles the whole every gen is infected early. They don't handle it well. They 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 think you're 220 plague, you know? They think that, oh, just wait 30 seconds, 35 seconds. And the spooky, stinky gen goes back to normal. 
But they can't. If they do that, one of their teammates gets hooked, as it happened. Look, I poke, I, I puked on that gen a million years ago. And it's still up. 70 seconds with these add-ons. With the other combination, literally two whole minutes. Wait, is it 70 seconds? 40... Yeah. And is it two minutes with the other? Yeah, I reckon so, right? Wait. It's 40 plus 40, so 80. Okay, it's not it's not two minutes. It's a hundred it's a minute and fifty, I reckon. Right? Yeah, it's a minute and fifty. I, I think two minutes is a bit of an exaggeration. Still, that's the entirety of corrupt pretty much. And don't forget, don't forget, if this girl is fully infected and she gets on a gen and she touches it, that timer resets because she's infecting the gem back. So you get on a gem that has 20 seconds of infection left to go. And in those 20 seconds, you get infected. Then you basically, as long as you touch it, the moment you get fully infected, you fully reset it. So at one point, oh, you can't infect pumpkins. Uh, at one point, it's super overkill. I think it might be better to just combine uh, apple and play and tablet. And then you do... You do this, right? You spawn, gen number one, puke, gem number two, puke, gen number three, gen number four. Then, if you can, you puke on things as you go. Uh, windows, pilots, try to get a person infected. And then... Pick up one of the two fountains from the... One of the two fountains from your apple. <laughs> then go to the sacrifice station and pick up... Thank you, thank you, Mr. Assistant. Pick up your mandatory Meg. And s sacrifice her to the god of the disconnection. Um, and then... Most, more likely than not, especially if the map is good, survivors will be very passive. They will not touch stinky gens, they'll think they can outweigh it. So by the time you drink up and you get it down, they're in a loose-loose. They they are waiting for the gens, and the gens are not gonna get de-infected anytime soon, or they're on the gens, and in a matter of 20 seconds, in a matter of 20 seconds, they're injured. <laughs> okay, uh, sure. You drop the pallet, I lose my power, and now you do all five gens by yourself. Uh, and by then, you have Tinkerer and Ruin. And if you haven't puked on the Ruin totem and it's gone, you have Tinkerer and Bob, which is still pretty damn good. Right? So I think your witch killer is right for you. Quiz on your website a while back, and it said I'd like pig. As it turns out, I absolutely do. Squirrel, people telling me that they have fun with my... With my killers that are suggested with the quiz that can only mean two things either the quiz is really accurate which i hope it is awesome or every killer can be fun if you go into it with an open mind which is also awesome so either way i'm super happy to hear thank you for the big dono and do please have the highest amount of possible fun hmm. you said to do the challenge well yeah plague is not a good killer like you almost always respect as a plague <laughs> yeah so yeah, that's that's my uh, conclusion on how to play the Plague Tablet. I think that it is a good strat, honestly. It is a good strat. Is it better than just double... Than, than just double... Uh, uh, double Apple with Lethal Pursuer? I don't know, maybe in some maps, yeah. Maybe in some maps, especially indoor maps and stuff. Like, survivors don't find gems. All of them are corrupted. They get injured. They're, like, that psychological pressure, I think that is... It's hard to quantify. You're not playing against a com team that knows exactly what to expect. You're playing against random people who have been playing against six blights, six nurses, and forty-five uh, spirits, up to up to that point, right? So, oh dear lord! All right, off you go, champ. How do you turn the camera? I have Q and E uh, binded so that I can do that. Why don't people play more Oni? I don't know. I guess his perks are not super good, so people don't unlock him for perks early on, and they just stick to other killers. I don't know. I don't think he's super hard or super bad or anything. I generally have no idea. Uh, 
And somebody in the chat did point out that he was farming. Um, but I'm sorry, I guess. I I think this guy is just a bit confused. Yeah, I don't think he's like trying to be malicious. Oh, sorry. Oh no. I'm out. Psh. 